As you set out for Ithaca, hope your road is a long one, full of adventure, full of discovery. May there be many summer mornings, when with what pleasure, what joy, you enter harbors you're seeing for the first time. May you stop at Venetian trading stations to buy fine things, mother of pearl and coral, amber and ebony, sensual perfume of every kind, as many sensual perfumes as you can. And may you visit many Egyptian cities to learn and go on learning from their scholars. Keep Ithaca always on your mind. Arriving there is what you're destined for. But don't hurry the journey at all. Better if it lasts for years, so you're old by the time you reach the island, wealthy with all you've gained on the way. Not expecting Ithaca to make you rich. Strong bond has existed between Naples and its airport for over 70 years. Naples boasted the first passenger terminal in Italy, with commercial flights commencing in 1950, in the infancy of air travel. In 1997, it was the first airport to be privatized in Italy. Giazacche is Naples' international airport management company under the terms of a 40-year concession agreement. FEDUI, Italy's largest and Europe's leading infrastructure fund, together with Ardiane, owns 82.65% of Giazacche stakes through a holding company Due Aeroporti. Passenger traffic has more than doubled in the past five years, registering a growth 2.5 times higher than the average for Italian airports. The number of scheduled airlines rose from 25 to 43, including all major European carriers. EasyJet and Ryanair, Europe's largest low-cost carriers, have established bases at Naples Airport and hired local staff. Volatea will also establish its base in May 2020. Intercontinental flights to New York and Dubai have been introduced this year, connecting Campania to North America and the Eastern Hemisphere. Over 100 destinations can be reached by direct flights from Naples, including 18 hub airports. The increased number of flight connections made Campania accessible from all parts of the world and facilitated the mobility of citizens and enterprises. In one word, it created connectivity. Just last year, Naples' connectivity grew four times more than the Italian average and six times more than the European average. According to Airport Council International, airport connectivity growth is closely linked to an increased GDP per capita in the region. This improved connectivity has especially enhanced tourism, international labour mobility and foreign investment. 20,000 jobs have been directly or indirectly produced by the airport. Airports are regarded as drivers of growth for tourism flows. In 2018, more than 6 million tourists visited Campania and inbound tourism grew by 43% compared to 2013, twice as much as the Italian average. China, you run a book. Naples ranks first in terms of number of films shot in the city in the past five years. And in 2019 it hosted the Universiadi. The airport supported this rapid and qualified growth by means of significant investments aimed at ensuring high standards of service and operational efficiency. When developing the airport, the management company paid special attention to the architectural quality of spaces. The result being a terminal where innovation and automation systems meet Italian style and design. The promotion of local excellences is coupled by an architecture that communicates to passengers the typical sentiment of the Campania region, Naples and its outstanding culture and history. This commitment got international recognition 
Commission in 2017, when Airport Council International awarded Naples Airport the prize for Best European Airport in the 5 to 10 million passengers category. Based on growth forecast supplied by leading carriers and international associations, air transport in Europe will double in size over the next 15 years. In order to keep up with this growth, Jaisak devised an ambitious plan to enhance air transport in the region. This will allow the tourist sector in Campania to fulfill its potential and to make the region a top European destination. October 2019, the act of merger by incorporation of the Salerno Costa d'Amalfi Airport into JESAC was signed, leading to the creation of the Campania Airport System. JESAC will manage the two terminals in an integrated way, thus increasing the overall airport capacity up to 18 million passengers. The Salerno Costa d'Amalfi Airport will be completely renovated, with an infrastructure investment of over 250 million euro. The passenger terminal will be totally rebuilt in compliance with environmental sustainability criteria and borrowing from the architecture of the Amalfi Coast and its cathedral. The first redevelopment phase of Salerno Airport will be completed in 2022. Until Salerno Airport becomes operational, Naples will have to meet the air transport demand of the region by itself in order to keep airlines from investing elsewhere. JISAC will invest a further 250 million euro in Naples Airport to implement measures aimed at improving flight operations and safety, as well as enhancing the airport accessibility. The terminal will be equipped with state-of-the-art technology in order to deliver a top quality service and offer an unforgettable experience to passengers. For the sustainable growth of Naples Airport, JISAC has set up a broad program of measures aimed at protecting the environment. In 2005, Naples was the first airport in Italy to put in place a monitoring system for noise abatement procedures, imposing sanctions in case of non-compliance by airlines and incentivizing carriers that use new generation aircrafts fitted with less polluting engines, such as the new A320neo. The noise monitoring system has now become a standard in all airports in Italy. In 2018, this system was completed with a control unit for air quality monitoring. JISAC is an active member of international organizations dedicated to finding solutions to mitigate GHG emissions. In 2018, Naples Airport got the highest certification level of the Airport Carbon Accreditation Program which certifies Naples as a CO2-neutral airport. In line with its sustainable growth approach, in 2021, Naples Airport will become plastic-free. The airport is part of the city's connective tissue and cooperates with entities or associations to support cultural and social projects aimed towards local communities. For example, it supports the enhancement of the artistic, cultural and botanic heritage of the Capri Monti Museum. Or the project Proud of You, against early school leaving. Accogliere Radarte, a project that provides training to key actors of the local tourism industry in order to create a widespread reception in the community. JISAC is in the front line when it comes to solidarity. Among others, it supports La Tenda, an association based on the Rione Sanità neighborhood which works with homeless people. In conjunction with the association L'Altra Napoli, JISAC plans to restore a 16th century complex that lies in a derelict state in the Forcella neighborhood. 
The building will be given back to local residents and will be included in tourist itineraries. The annex garden and the premises will be used for educational and recreational activities organized for the children of Forcella. The project Mili Alberi per la Città is ambitiously aimed at planting 1,000 new trees in areas adjacent to the airport that currently lie in a state of neglect in order to give new green lungs to the city. as you will have become so full of experience. You will have understood by then what these Ithacas mean.